Alright, so I decided to go ahead and just not do that whole snowy wyvern thing. It just seemed kind of pointless. Um, so I'm just not doing that. Uh, but, um, I'm kind of trying to make this internal decision as to whether or not I want to do the next, um, main quest. Or if I want to do the final little side quest thing that we have over here. If I, if I do one of them, then it's, I might not be able to do, well, actually, hold on a second. What is this, 20? No, yeah, I'll be able to do the other one no matter what. Alright, in that case, I'm going to go ahead and do this. I'm sure a lot of you want to get to the next thing, uh, but I wanted to get this last one out of the way. I think that it will probably take up maybe one or two videos. I don't know. Something along those lines. Um, I'll try not to, you know, drag it along too much, but I would like to get it out of the way. So, it's called Stop Venatory Activity in the West. Uh, Liliana's spies have discovered orders from the Venatory's high-ranking commanders. A large number of mages are traveling westward to excavate something of great value to our cause. The Inquisition... Blah. The Inquisition must find whatever its enemies are searching for. The region is vast, but Liliana is ready to put her network to use in tracking down Corypheus's minions. Who is it that can do? Oh, secrets. Okay. Benatori are setting some of their best scholars into the wilderness. Let us discover precisely where they are heading. The Venatori are camped in a place known as the Hissing Waste. They're working their slaves to death, digging old buildings out from the sand. The Inquisition should step in quickly, because if it doesn't, I'm going to bash the Venatori's heads in. And you'll need a new scout. Lead Scout Harding. Let's go for it! Any luck charting the area? I did what I could, Your Worship. This space has nothing but... space. If there's nothing valuable here, I say let Corypheus have it. Corypheus wouldn't send out his followers unless it was worth it. I did find something for you. Old dwarven ruins, on the surface. Impossible, but there you go. The Red Templars are digging them out, with Venatori supervision. Whatever they want, we must beat them to it. I just saw Red Templars heading northwest to here. They might be a good start. I found this map on a dead one. Maybe it shows where they're headed. Good luck. Okay. Sketch of four pillar tomb. Ah, all right. So from the middle of the page, you see that little skull and the little kind of flashing light thing. I'm assuming that means I need to find one of those little skull things, look through it, and find a um, a shard. And I bet that shard will lead me to the four pillars. One of the shards. I, obviously, it's not any particular one. I don't care. Ooh, I like this. It's all dark out. I think this is the first place that I've done that was actually really dark. That's really neat, though. Big moon. Okay, so what we have over here is, uh... There's a sizable venatory presence in the Hissing Wastes. It is an odd place for them to be dispatched at all, let alone in such significant numbers. So search the venatory camp north of the cove. There's a few rifts just north of here. Wow, there's seven camps. Jesus. Then we have this other one that doesn't seem to have any particular reason for being there. But whatever. Um, Alright, so... I guess I'll get a couple of these rifts out of the way. Because why not? I'm pretty sure that the leveling here is like 16 or so. Which, you know, I'm like 18 at the moment, I believe. Yeah, I'm 18, everyone else is 17. So there's that. Alright, so here's the thing I'm a little confused about. Okay, so they said that there was a... Uh, dwarven ruin on the surface. But then they also said that, that the Venatori are digging it out. But maybe they're digging out whatever they're looking for. Maybe it was just kind of a weird sort of miscommunication. I just misunderstood what she was saying. Um, but no matter what, a Dwarven Ruin being on the surface, that's very strange. You know, and that's, uh, certainly perplexing. Ooh, there's, uh, one of those things over there. Alright. Who knows, this might lead me to where I'm looking for. So I'll be sure to keep my eye out for those four pillars. Actually... Hold on a second. Let's just try to... Let's get the shards out of the way. Might as well. Oh, 
Okay, what are we looking for? That looks like it was in the map right there. Right, and so was this. I know this was here, or there, this was in the map. So I need to go down that way. Are those lights in the distance? They may yes. be campfires. Let's have a look. Those are lights. So we gotta find those pillars. Okay, let me go into the quest map real quick. Collections. Maps? Anywhere? No? Alright. Ah, eh, fuck it. Let's go ahead and take a look. What's the harm? Am I right? Alright, what are you? Oh, shit, you're level 18. So we have just the amount of leveling that we need to be in this section. I'm lucky. Alright, I've managed to get most of this crap out of the way. Um, if you look at the map here, uh, I've gotten, uh, f what was it, six? Yeah, I think six of the seven camps uh, located. And funny enough, when I came across this last camp right here, I found the uh, pillars. <laughs> They're right there. That's pretty awesome. There's also a, co a couple enemies out in the distance. Hopefully, I can get in here without having to worry about that. There's a couple of new quests, apparently, to pick up from here. Uh, Sand-covered note. Lephis, I expected the wagon we sent out to the canyons to return to the watchtower by evening. It is now past noon. That it does not take... Wait. That it does not take a half day to travel from camp to camp should be obvious. But if no one has the sense to be alarmed, look for them immediately upon finishing this letter. Take archers with you. Those spiders in the canyons seem to be f uh, seem to fear nothing, but that screeching monster to the east. I'll be by the four pillars. Devrenix, or Devrenix. I don't know. Uh, Esteris, the work goes well, but we're bound to be followed sooner or later. I've set up watch on higher ground in the Sunstop Mountains, obviously named by someone who never beheld a real mountain. If you're looking for uh, that guy. Uh, he is looking for the tomb in the canyons to the west, Magister Urathus. So there were a couple of quests I just picked up. I didn't read them. Um, let's see. Uh, a patrol has gone missing in the bone fields between the canyon camp and the four pillars. Locate the missing patrol. What's the other one? Um, uh, rumors tell of a grand treasure buried in a tome in the hissing waste. Explore the waste using any available clues and maps to find it. Follow the treasure map to the tomb. So, I pretty much just found the, uh, the tomb. So, uh, I think that I'm good in that respect. And these guys, I, I just kind of got by. I, I, I came down that way. And just kind of, and I was on my horse. Um, and I just kind of came up to the camp that was right there and uh, never got caught. So, I just, got, I, I probably just got lucky. Well, you know, I'll take it. I think I found some treasure down here. Okay, so... Another little note here. I heard some creepy sort of noises. I guess it's nothing. Uh... Well, yeah, that's actually pretty long, but I'll read it. Uh, demons of the stone, until further notice, do not tamper with the torches. Lighting them in the wrong order summons demons. The inscriptions on the pillars indicate the correct order, but wait until we have confirmed the accuracy of our translations before proceeding. I have made maps of the other tombs where there are similar structures. Let the same warning stay your hand there. Magister Gallus. Below this, someone else has written complicated formulas and scribbled many notes. Demons bound into the rock. How do the ancient dwarves manage, manage it without mages? Binding runes, subtle properties of stonework. Investigate. Uh, Ganja? Gang? I don't know. Carved into walls. Could be translated from Old Dwarven as stone waste or impure spirit of the stone. 
Dwarven superstition saw demons as impure spirits of rock. A study impossible with dormant demons. Ask Cephas and Eurathus for help with binding. Okay, so... Sketch of Sun Stop Mountain Tomb. All right, so there's more than one tomb, apparently. So I have to I have to energize these in the right order. Or I'm in some deep shit. Yeah, the door is magically sealed. All right, it didn't give me a uh, correct order, so I guess I'm just going to kind of have to base this off, off of luck, I suppose. Is there any way to indicate... Oh, there's uh, things behind here. This is the tale of Feral, Paragon among Paragon's father to sons. For pride, these halls were made to honor a father's deeds and grieve his loss. Who, against their father's wishes, fought from foolish words and foolish pride. Wait, okay. I, I think that... And for loss, these halls were made to honor a brother mourned. Okay, so this is in order. Okay. Father of two sons. So what would be next? Who, against their father's wishes, fought from foolish... Pr okay. Maybe that one. Another thing is I need to take a look at punctuation. Okay, did this end with... A okay, this ended with a comma. Alright, so, the next word would not be capitalized, so and isn't- so that's How not the next one. How do you get your hair to do that, Dorian? With magic? With proper hygiene and grooming. Maybe all three of you should get acquainted. This should be the right one first. Yeah, nobody's attacking me. Alright, so this would be the next one. Yep, nothing so far. Okay, so. Let's just read these real quick. Uh, this is the tale of Feral, Paragon among Paragons, father of two sons, comma. Who, against their father's wishes, fought from foolish words and foolish pride. Period. For pride these halls were made to honor a father's deeds and grieve his loss. Okay, so, I mean, it's a continuation of pride, so this is probably the next one, but let's just read that last one one more time, real quick. And for loss these halls were made to honor a brother mourned. Okay, yeah, alright. I would be very surprised if this isn't the next one. Yeah, I think I got it. Hello. A burial chamber, I think. I am so smart. Yeah, you just gotta take a look at the context, man. Keep track of punctuations and all that stuff. Got a mosaic piece. That's nice. 99 gold, a torn paper drawn on tattered... P okay, directions. Uh, map of Tomb of Pharrell. There's a key fragment. Bianca Arms, Masterwork Spiked Longbow. And Superb Ring of Attack. What does that do for me? Uh, accessories. It's just plus 10% attack. Alright, excellent. Uh, what am I wearing currently? Poison weapons ring. And ring of flanking. Alright, let's, uh, get rid of that. And we will... Go ahead and use the, uh... Attack. Matter of fact, I probably should get rid of the other one. And use dexterity. Wait. No, not shit. Oops, I didn't realize. That's an amulet of dexterity. Fuck, I don't remember what the other amulet was. Oops. I think it was a cooldown am amulet. Alright, in that case... <coughs> Excuse me. So I think I have everything here. Alright, so that was one tomb. There's apparently more than that. There's a tomb for Feral, or Feral, however you pronounce his name. So I'll be sure to keep track of that, if I ever find it. It looked like it had two, like, dwarves uh, holding hammers or something like that. 
So I guess that's how I'll know if I've come across it. But we have found number one. Uh, but now that that's out of the way, let's go ahead and uh, do the main quest. Okay, so there's a missing patrol out there. Should we go and take a look at that? I feel like we should. Okay, so just to read it again, a patrol has gone missing in the bone fields between the canyon and the four pillars. If I uh, locate the missing patrol after that, um, hmm. I feel like that was over here for some reason. There's a sizable venatory presence of the hissing waste, low, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, All right, that's weird. I feel like that moved for some reason. Whatever. Anyway, we're going to go and take care of this patrol, then we'll take a look at the venatory presence right afterward. See you guys in a second. Alright, so we're here now. And I think I found the missing patrol. I think they were attacked by spiders. Oh, fucking hell. That thing is big. Dark spawn alpha shield. Yeah, what she has is currently better than that, so... Oh, the VTAR might actually be better for, uh... Shit. Um, sorry, Iron Bull. I thought I just located Your them. Your earlier judgment of the Seekers was unfair, Dorian. Oh? Were they not responsible for keeping peace with the mages? And what would you say if one judged Tevinter solely on the actions of some of its magisters and slavers? Yes, let us dismiss your homeland as not having a single redeeming quality. The Seekers failed, without question. But the situation was complex, and you well know it. I, I could have sworn that was the missing patrol that I just found, but apparently it's not. Oh, fuck you. Okay, so evidently there was two, uh, or there were two venatory camps. Um, that's why I was a little confused earlier. The one I'm currently looking for is near the canyon. There's another one that's known as the Watchtower, which is uh, a little bit uh, further north of here. It's actually uh, the final camp that I have not located just yet. Or located isn't the right word. Founded, I suppose, is a uh, better usage. Hello? Okay, so another tomb down there. Oh, Jesus. Uh, short note, um, hold on a sec, find the graveyard tomb's treasure, find the canyon tomb's tre- God, there's a lot of treasure. Okay, I'm returning to the main camp, don't linger past sunset, we were working by torchlight past dark, when a horde of spiders poured out of the canyon's rocks. There are red templars on patrol, but if the overseer wants us to go faster, he should ask the wretched brutes to guard us while we work. We already have enough, uh, wait, sorry, we already have few enough venatory after the disaster at Redcliffe. Something the Red Templars have taken planes to remind us about, I've noticed. Um, are all Templars in the south this haughty? Uh, Harmonum. I think is the correct usage of the word. Oh, they, I, I think I was already there. Shit. That looks vaguely familiar. Shit, where'd he go?
Alright, I'm hopeful that just going through these camps, like... I'm hopeful that they, they, they just don't, uh, they don't just lead me to, like, uh, more treasure maps. Because that's really fucking boring, again. Like, uh, These little side quest areas really are, are disappointing, I've got to say. In the sense that they're all... Just a bunch of, like, go get this, go get that, go do that. I know I've said this a million times, but they've done it a million times. So it's like, I'm going to keep bitching about it until they fucking stop doing it. You know, it's really annoying. But, you know, whatever. Uh, it's still, I guess, I guess it's still kind of fun. Anyway, let's uh, go to this last place over here. I wonder what's going to happen. Oh, wait, I think this is another one of the tombs. Yeah, because it has the two uh, dwarves holding their uh, their hammers up. That sounds oddly sexual. Huh. I'm a little bit confused, though. Oh, fuck. I need to go down over here. There's got to be a tomb somewhere down here, though. Obviously, I need to go up there. But yeah, I could have sworn I saw one of the maps tell me that uh, there's a tomb just over here somewhere. Oh, that's odd. Alright, well, I'm not going to dwell on it. Uh, maybe I'll come across it later. Who knows? But that is kind of strange. That visual just kind of resonates in my head. I could have sworn I saw it earlier. God, I'm glad that I don't have that, that like, cold voice now. I mean, I'm still having some of the, the effects from it, but, uh... I think I sound, for the most part, I sound like my old self again. Which I'm certainly happy about. Nope, that was an accident. Oh, wait, I think I just, wait, is that it? I need to stop saying things preemptively. What's this over here? Oh. Alright, cool. Ah, uh, there's something. Venatory helmet. Schematic for that, so that's good, I suppose. Alright, never mind. I thought that that was the tomb right there, but it's... Even if it is, it's blocked off, at least at the moment, so... Can't really access it. Oh, there's a camp over there. How did I not see that before? Huh. Maybe we'll go over there later. I want to check this out, because obviously the Venatory camp's up here. You know, it's the watchtower, so... That would make sense. Got another dwarf. Statue. Sunstop Mountains. I recognize this as well. This is another place where uh, the tomb was located. Okay. A lot of climbing involved here. 
I must say. Damn it. Oh, I thought that was a, a chest for loot or something right there, but it was just a log. Idiot. What do we got going over here? Hmm. I gotta say, I was expecting more um, enemies. You know? I think there was gonna be like a ton of people to attack us or something. Oh, we got the last camp right up there. I'll check that out in a second. Just wanna be sure I have everything clear before we do it. Yeah, I gotta say. Um, overall, I think this is actually shorter, uh, if this is the only other thing, and then there's those, you know, tombs, which are kind of... Yeah, it's just a bunch of loot. Um, I would have to say that overall, this is probably shorter than the Exalted Plains, and it costs 12 more power. Which is rather odd, in my opinion. You wouldn't think it would work that way. Where does this lead? Oh, we got another... Oh, never right. I don't know what that does, but I'm taking it. You know what? I bet this is the skull that tells me... Maybe not. Never mind. I just remember one of the first maps I saw, it had like a skull as like one of the... Um, parts of, uh... The... Like, kind of visual... Elements to indicate, like, where one of the tombs are, but... Like, I figured that the skull would kind of, like... Well, I said it earlier, but it would tell me more where, where the shard, uh, like, a certain shard is, and, uh, that shard would lead me to the tomb, and that has not really happened yet. I thought that would be kind of cool. Alright, but enough screwing around. Let's, uh... Let's get over this camp. I'm not going to be able to sneak by these guys, though. I mean, they're right in front of it. Okay, what do we have here? Okay, we've got a vel Venatory Spellbinder, a Zealot. F yeah, I don't need to worry about him. And a Brute that is very powerful. I feel like I kind of wasted that. Uh oh. Yeah, I probably shouldn't have used that up. That was probably kind of stupid, but oh well. That's the last of them here. This would make a good lookout post. All right, Venatory Orders. Members of the Venatory, we are close to unearthing the secrets the old dwarves buried here. The Elder One will doubtless. Uh, will doubtless be pleased with our success, but be vigilant. While our work has gone well, the Inquisition and their false herald were uh, seen traveling towards the wastes. Uh, travel together and go armed. Trevelyan may have no magic other than the anchor, but the damnable rogue has eluded death more times than could be natural. Um, we cannot allow the Inquisition to take this place from us. If you are pressed, retreat to our main camp behind the Sunstop Mountains. Extra guards will be posted. Alright, so there's another camp that I need to take a look at, apparently. Then there's the Colossus Tomb. Alright, so where's this new camp? It's not too far from here, actually. There will probably be one more somewhere down here. Okay, so let's go ahead and save real quick. Let's upgrade... Uh, I guess Blackwall and Cassandra. 
Dorian's still level 17, unfortunately. Uh, this is whirl or rising winds, not whirlwind, but uh, we'll upgrade that, sure. And uh, Cassandra. Yeah, the chain thing's kind of boring. Uh, you deal more damage against enemies that are stunned or knocked out better them than you. Uh, when you attack a target from behind, you leave them slowed. I might just get a new ability and just replace it with the uh, chain grapple thing. Through faith and will, you dispel all hostile, hostile, ma Jesus, hostile magic from the area around you. Or uh, wrath of heaven, you summon a blinding pillar of light that stuns nearby enemies and damages demons. I like it. Okay, so we'll use that. Uh, Wrath of Heaven. Replace that. Perfect. Save again. And let's go ahead and head on down to the Ven Venatory Camp in the mountains. Which is somewhere this way. There's also apparently a... Uh... Shit, what, are they, what is it called? I keep on forgetting what they're called. Uh, Rift. Jesus. <laughs> 42 parts in and I, have for I keep forgetting that they're called Rifts. Um, but yeah, there's one of those in the way, unfortunately, but I don't think that would be that big of a problem. Hey. Okay, so what are we looking for here? I'm hopeful that the tombs are just like kind of an additional thing. It's like, hey, here's all this really cool treasure you can pick up. But the main thing is finding out what the hell's going on out here. Because I felt kind of let down by the uh, exalted planes in all honesty. Oh, wow. Now you're dead. Oh, shit, sir. Yeah, I definitely wasted my abilities on that guy. The last time I faced one of the brutes, that is. Okay. That was surprisingly easy. I thought that was going to take up a whole ton of my uh, potions and all that, but nope. Nope, I'm fine. None too worse for wear. Hello. Alright, now hold on a second. How what do you know of my kind, Blackwall? I know that what comes out of your mouth is the same drivel that comes out of theirs. It might sound that way to someone who's been clubbed on the head too often. Careful, I don't club you on the head. That's what I'd expect from your kind. Ooh. Sounds like people don't like each other too much. Oh, Dorian can level up now. Good thing I found this. A little concerned I didn't know where to go. Oh, there's two brutes. Ah, oh, fuck.
Jesus Christ, these guys are easy to kill. Actually, I probably should take a look at my inventory. Alright, now I'm fine. Alright, now where do I go? Down here? Oh, okay. Hello. I almost feel as though that the brutes are easier to kill than those guys. The, uh, zealots, I think is what they're called. Maybe I'm just a psycho. my way god damn it yeah where are we going exactly we're just <laughs> I know like there's obviously some sort of destination here but I don't understand what we're looking for is just search the, the camp until we find a letter that tells us to go somewhere else. Oh, what's your name? You look special. Overseer. Ooh. Uh-oh. Alright, well, Overseer's dead now. Whoa, hold on a second. He's electricity resistance, um, but he's also vulnerable to it. How the fuck does that work? How are you electrically resistant, but also electrically vulnerable? That is a total contradiction. Makes no f no sense. Oh god, that hurt a lot. Alright, fine. Uh... Come on. You're next. You're just a regular spellbinder. This place is massive. How long have they been here? This must have been the Venatori's main camp. Come on. We should still find what they were after. Blood Wake, which is actually a little bit better than, uh... Well, actually, I don't know, now that I think about it. Right, that's for Dorian. I think that, uh... The more, the more that I consider it, I think... That, uh, uh... Shit. Wow, I'm really going blank right now. What's his name? Um, guy who loves talking about the Fade. He's an elf, uh, mage. Uh, Solus. I think Solus actually already has that, but we'll, we'll take a look. Okay, so, draft of letter to Venatory Magisters. Fellow Magisters, we have been given a chance to redeem ourselves after one of our own failed Corypheus at Redcliffe. The dwarven relics in the tombs are instructions on recreating the masterpieces of one of their finest paragons. They are to be excavated, replicated, and brought back for study. The Elder One is generous to let us prove our worth. We cannot disappoint him. Do not spare the slaves. Speed is crucial to our success. Let us set an example to the rest of the Venditori, mages and commoners both, with our obedience to the Elder One's will. Overseer Julix. Which is the guy that we just killed, I suppose. Alright, so I think we just solved the mystery, and we stopped them from putting together some sort of paragon that could really mess things up for the Inquisition. I'll probably still check out some of these tombs. I don't know if I'll record them, though. I don't... Hmm. That's the thing, though. It's like, should I? Because that's gonna be a lot of looking, you know? 
huh? I'm not sure, man. Because that could really take a long time. I think we'll hold off on that. I think that, um... I think that next time... We're actually going to go ahead and check out... Ooh, what the hell is that? Oh, those are just dead people hanging. Um, we're going to go ahead and check out the main quest. I can't remember what it was called off the top of my head, but you know what I'm talking about. Um, back at the war table. And uh, so we'll just pick it up in the next one. Before I do my little outro, I just want to ask anybody um, who has experienced uh, the stuff with the tombs, is there anything extremely, extremely valuable, like something that could be really helpful to me um, or one of my companions. If so, I will go ahead and check it out. Um, I just want to know and be sure, uh, just so I don't miss anything that's, you know, extremely important. Um, otherwise, uh, we're gonna go ahead and stop it here. So, if you enjoyed the video, please be sure to like and subscribe and all that, and I will see you guys next time.